the game. You know, sometimes I think, like, Leo just, you know, does, like, the optimal thing, you know, because he's always trying to win. But sometimes I think he knows that he wants to end in style. He's like, yeah, like, that, that plays like, for the people sometimes, you know? If, if you guys saw, it, it was a really good, uh, really good, like, video that they did. Uh, shout out to Hungerbox for doing this one. He did uh, Hot Wands. Oh, yeah. yeah, yeah his that, that was really good. Yeah, that was really good. It was a really good MK Leo interview. But he talked about how, like, eventually... There is like a, a, a percentage of him that is really good and a percentage of the character that's also really good. But not only that, his ability to just kind of know when you're at the higher level. Like you just know that this is going to connect. And MKLeo definitely demonstrates this a lot. Well, let's go to another top level player here. And Larry Lur, he's starting to make a comeback here in SoCal. This past season, you know, it wasn't too hot for him. Him and Boyd definitely took a lot of significant L's last season. But now Larry, you know, here in locals at MSM, especially with Leo and Cosmos, you know, two... Two names to have under the belt for sure if you want to get PR next season in a higher placing. Yeah, I really want to see what this, how this is going to go since Larry did beat his Marth in uh, winners today. Mm -hmm. And now he's using his, uh, you know, much more polished, I guess, you seen a like, better character anyway. So yeah. I want to see what the adjustments are going to be for Larry here to take this one over Larry. I would imagine not too much. Honestly, the one thing that Monk Marth has over Lucina is like um, sour spot combos. You know, like Sour Spot up air into other options, but like the one thing that Lucina has overall is kill power, which sometimes Morph can lack. This is a really good side to come back on the stage, and MKLeo tries to get that shield push to center stage. Yeah, he's trying to get some fancy stuff on Leo, or sorry, on Larry, but Larry kind of saw through that and got the easy up smash. But yeah. can he come back to the stage? Yeah, Ooh. nice. And Larry gets a nice angle here to come back on the stage. MKLeo kind of respects the up B because it's really, really tough to kind of punish Wolf up B. At times, you kind of have to give a little respect. If you wanted to punish it, maybe go for counter. But I felt that the speed was too fast in the back air. Evens up the pace to two, uh, two stocks to two stocks. Yeah, Larry didn't let him get anything off that stock lead. Exactly what you want to do in a matchup like this. Player like this, anyway. Yeah. Larry, Larry with momentum kind of scary, as you can see from that last game. <laughs> <laughs> if you give this man momentum, dude, he takes more than a mile. That man is light years ahead of you. All right, he's starting to get some jumps here. I think he rec recognized Larry. He has very little jumps, so he's just keeping him Stop. in the air over and over. I just love to see him. I'm telling you, dude. So he smart. brought a beach ball to the stadium. Yeah. And the crowd loves it. Yeah, uh, I punished him for going him. for Nair. Yeah, it's going to send him really far off stage. Yeah, Larry likes to do ledge jump aerials quite a bit. So uh, he's got to be careful of that. Leo definitely has all the tools to punish it. Mm -hmm. if, uh, he does it too often. Good. Wait for the recovery there. He wanted to see if he was going to get up attack or go for a, a get up roll. So Larry wanted to make sure he caught the right option. I'm seeing a lot of empty hops, a little solid spacing here. So Larry is looking to hit a back a really well spaced forward tilt, man. If I were anybody, I'd be really scared, but you're surviving when you're living like Larry. Back throw, stage advantage, edge guard. Yeah, I'm looking for a big edge guard here for Larry. Oh, oh he coming in with that in there. The spacing was so good from Leo. He like was right outside of range for the uh, the neutral air to connect. And there's mm -hmm. another up throw off the top. He has a, he's always had that slight rage, too, to just make sure his up throw kills just that little bit percent earlier. Yeah. Compared to Smash 4, up throw will kill a lot later than what it used to. It should be like 160-ish. Now in this game, it's more definitely like on the higher percent, like 178 to like 182 on some characters, and depending if Lucina has a way, um, rage or not. Yeah. Oh, oh, he caught the slight jump. Leo trying to jump a little bit out of the corner, maybe start some aerial pressure for his own, but very with that clean anti-air up smash from Wolf, really good at closing out stocks in that way, but... Now he's going to have to find a way to get past Lucina at the ledge here. Leo kind of locking him down where he wants. All right, there's an air. Push advantage. Oh. Get the stage control here. Yeah, he's, he's got, he's got my man Larry in the corner. All right, see, so he's getting center stage, but now he has to really make do with uh, stage control. He's going to see set some Texas to, you know, basic Wolf BNB down throw dash attack. Mm, Larry, Le Leo has not punished that yet. Larry has been going for, I mentioned earlier, He's been going for a lot of these empty hops with these back airs and these aerials. So Leo has yet to open his down. Okay, I, should, I, should I try to whiff punish him for an empty hopping on me? Or should I try to go ahead and try to find an option that gets rid of it? Oh, yeah, and Larry hasn't learned the mistakes that he has, right? You said he always likes to come with a get up aerial. And Leo there for the punishment. Yeah, I just noticed that from watching a lot of his uh, matches from even uh, like from Nightmare on Smashville. Just seeing a lot, him play a lot more, that he does kind of opt for that ledge jump aerial. I mean, I don't see him get punched for it too often, but when he does, it's usually a stock. So I'd love to see him mix up. Well, he gets up left. Totally off topic, but I, I like MKLA with blonde hair. I don't know, like if you, if you saw Hua Juan's, he, had the, yeah. he was rocking the blonde hair. Now it's more like the reddish brown. I don't know how many times Leo didn't dye his hair over the course of the last two months, man. I, I don't know. He's almost done the whole rainbow at this point. I, I don't know what he's on anymore. I can't even dye my hair, man. Curly hair is a curse. 
Sorry. Anyways, let's get back into it, man. <laughs> but uh, yeah, I would. Uh, I'm really curious to see what Leo's gonna do to mix up his like off ledge uh, mm -hmm. option because Leo's gonna punch that really hard. Oh, he put this man on the other side of the corner. He says, man, you ain't putting me anywhere but the other side. Sorry, fam. Okay. Nice, tries to land with an aerial and he kind of takes advantage. Good oh. opportunity to send that back here because Leo likes to also go for aerials, but he mix, mixes him up there with the force at the last second. Yeah, I couldn't tell if, because it looked like Leo turned around, like facing off stage, and maybe pressed the button there. I'm not sure what he was going for. It looked like a missing input, but we take those. I mean, he, he leaves very little openings regardless, so when he does make a mistake like that, you got to take what you can get. For Larry, that's really good because, you know what, it lets him know gods do bleed. <laughs> yeah, for real. <laughs> oh, see, okay, he got away with that near that time, but, yeah, Leo is like, Leo is, uh, he's, like, backing off from the ledge just a little bit to bait Larry to try to chase him towards mm -hmm. the center, and he's punching him. Oh, dang, oh, that. Excuse me. That arc. <laughs> you see the swing on that? Well, that's the thing about Lucina, too. Like, you have to really imagine kind of like a circle or a bubble around her because that's her range. And then that picture that bubble at all times because if you're within that bubble, you will get hit by any of her air sword moves. Yeah, that's a part of what makes her much more consistent than like, Marth right now. Yeah. I mean, Maggie. That's why, that's why Luc I tell people, man, Marth is Lucina's echo fighter. She told that old <laughs> man, like, you, man, you were good for too many games, man. It's time for the youngins to shine. I feel like that's what MKLeo is telling Larry. Like, man, you old. <laughs> Damn, I didn't have to take it there, dude. Damn, I don't blame him, bro. I'm old too. I can't even comprehend these button presses right now. <laughs> Alright, Leo did a decent job bringing this all the way back. Kind of did keeping Larry on the back foot here. Oh, now they're kind of scrambling. Ooh, no nice. Good tech read, yeah, too. Yeah, great tech chase with the dancing blade. Oh, there it is. That ledge jump gets caught, but he has a jump still. Ooh, Ooh good tech. Crucial tech. At the perfect time there. He channeled the inner fox man. He's oh. like, oh no. Nice. Good Great pot. dolphin slash out of shield. Larry trying to get that easy cross up with that amazing wolf there, but Leo seeing right through that option. But catches Leo's ledge jump there. Oh, he went so deep. He's. Oh nice. no. This is why he's the best player in the world. Ever, Who is the best? Who is the best? Let me tell you how many times I see Larry get that super deep wolf air on people, just like on so many characters. And I never seen anyone actually just kill oh, him for missing man. that. It's like Larry committed to the first. He wanted to kiss on the first date, and Leo said, "No, nah, man, I'm a lady of stature." Damn. He Wait. actually, I think Le uh, I have to go back and look at it, but I think Leo was actually purposely drifting far back. Yeah, he was. He was. Zone. He was. Even even when like, what's amazing too is that Larry hit Leo with Nair at the ledge, and and Leo survived at like one fifty one. Yeah, it was kind of stale though because he hit him with it like two or three times. Before. Yeah, but uh, Larry just saw he pushed him really far off stage, wanted to you know just close it out, but then he just got super baited there by Leo. Oh, trying to get the tech chase, but unfortunately Leo will make the tech instead. Forward air put this man off the stage. Leo saves the jump. We're saving jumps in twenty nineteen, ladies and gentlemen. I feel like Leo made in Cloud so many years in Smash 4. Like, he learned to save his double jump off stage. Oh, for sure. Because if you weren't, that's <laughs> dying to everybody. Man, you paid oh, the price. Geez. Oh, and then that's the final thing. We can air Larry combos into so much, bro. Oh, excuse me. He Star says, Larry, you can't hold advantage for too long. I can't let God. you do that, Star Wolf. Dang, that was so powerful. There's no way you were living <laughs> that Wolf Flash game counter like that. So much percent. I want to go back and look and see how much percent that did. All right. Kind of a, even again from these guys. No, Larry hasn't been doing too bad in the stage. Just hasn't been able to clutch it out, honestly. Good forward tilt. Ooh. Kind of slow oh, easing the jump again. The the lead in the air. Oh, yep. he, yeah, he makes sure he's dead. Oh, he's making sure yeah. he's never coming back. Haven't they taught you a lesson, old man? Actually, Leo, I think he was already dead. But then Leo back at him again and gave him enough time to directional air dodge and do it. But then he's like, oh, wait, man, I'm actually going to kill you now. <laughs> <laughs> It's like that moment where we're like, stop, Leo, please, he's already dead. <laughs> Almost gets it back air. Really good to Larry. Larry knows the confirms here, but it seems like Leo is kind of making sure he's held, holding the right DI and making sure he's just under them enough to punish them. That's what I'm talking about. Like, he's, down here, down here. he knows. But B, this is kind of slipping away from Larry right now because he's really in a position where he's forced to get the kill. Slipped away, man. This thing looks Leo's like sand in his this looks like sand in his hands, man. Yeah, it's been yeah. falling off. Yeah, Leo is in that position where I don't care how much I, I trade with you because I'm still in the lead, but 85% is 
still kind of risky just because, you know, the nature of uh, Leo's punish game here is kind of scary. But Ooh, let's see. That spacing from Leo was really good enough to avoid the grab and then still try to punish Leo with a side B. Down throw dash attack. Oh, no, he's going for a tech chase. Nice. Nice. Larry slowly bringing this back. I said it was slipping away from his hands like sand, but unfortunately for Leo, you can never count out this old man because he's still got tricks. All the young people watching on the screen. Oh, oh I, I, I yeah. changed. <laughs> Leo's face. Leo's face. <laughs> <laughs> I, I stand corrected, man. I stand corrected. Yeah, with the commentator's curse from deep. 